top fucking buzz this. I'm peeking on the blood pressure alone. Yeah, terrific. Well, well, well. What do we got here? Here's your sandwich. Who's this pretty thing? I don't usually do this kind of shit, you know. <laughs> I like this girl. What's your name, kid? Maria. And the service is not included. I ain't the woman, you fat fuck! You heard the bird. Come on. <laughs> Are you kidding me? See you later, guys. And who's this asshole? The name's Carl Johnson, sir. Before working with Mr. Rosenberg here, I had the pleasure of doing business with your son, Joey, back in Liberty City. You know my Joey? I like that. So, kid, what can I do for you? Well, Ken, if vouch for me, I'm a straight killer. Oh, but one man fucking army. A, a real dependable. Total fucking maniac, too. You know, the Ferrellis are sending over a crew to hit me. Their flight gets in soon. Traveling is a string quartet. <laughs> I was gonna send some of the boys over as a little welcoming committee. But, uh, maybe you can take care of it. Thank you, sir. I guarantee you, you won't regret this. Uh, maybe I should go Whoa! around with that. That, that, that. You where you are, Rosenberg. I don't want you getting yourself lost. Stay tuned. It's the Wild Traveler. Next. Hello, I'm James Podesta, World Traveler, and this is the Wild Traveler. From Peru to San Andreas in eight days by balloon, often while lounging around garden parties, we could get the brave workers worldwide who toil day and night for the products we consume. Some are even so dedicated to our happiness they carry products and balloons shoved inside themselves to be a balloon. We go to the phones. Yes, we do. I can't believe you actually recommended we go to Barbados on our honeymoon. It was insulting. You were poor people. I live in Vinewood to be away from poor people. Barbados is lovely. Look, I want to be very clear. I'm not racist. Just careful. Okay. I like all inclusive reports. So you can use as much as you want, be around other people from San Andreas. And the only interaction you have with the locals is if you need a cocktail or with some spice in the bed when you're the best friend. Well, that sounds lovely. With people like you, it's no wonder we don't bother curing cancer. Next caller, you're on the Wild Traveler. Whoa! Yeah, it's funny. You go on and on about other countries. But you live here. America rules you, commie. Easy. Well, we'll be on trying. Tom, you're on the line. Casino in Ventura's that is just like the rest of the world, only with better toilets and full of morons like you. Do you want culture or do you want safety? It's your choice. Personally, I want irrigation of the colonic variety, but that's a whole different story. And it is anyway. Let's go to the phones. Who's on the phones? No one. Come on, call up. Anyone? It wouldn't be like this in Peru, I can tell you. There I once made a phone call with 30 boys sitting on my lap. Not because I paid them. They wanted to be there. Or in Mali, where nobody knows where the phone is, and a lot of people have never even heard of plastic surgery, or the glory of...
Travel. There is something very exotic about him, a Brinda. He could be a boy, but like many locals, in certain lights he looks just like a little girl. He is a real minx who knows exactly what he is doing to me. Oh, wrong page. Here I A Brinda took me deep into jungle, and there we took part in an ancient rite of passage for adolescents from the past. We hunt each other in game, very similar to the ancient games of Kiss Chase I used to play. No! Wrong page! Abrinda has left me. I'm broken. I thought I meant something. But it seems he would rather become a fisherman than follow me in an exotic life of degeneracy and narcotics as my houseboy. I hate myself. Why does this keep happening to me? Hell! Wrong bit again! Where's the page about watching the elephants, mate? and it being really disturbing and making me slightly jealous for both parties. Hey, has someone been stealing pages out of my journal? My producer is jealous. He keeps stealing my stuff and lending it to people. Just last week I heard him saying government agents wanted to look at it. What a... Got a heart, huh?